Missouri Appeals Court overturned the murder conviction of a one-time UMKC student serving 40 years for killing a newspaper editor. Now defense attorneys for Ryan Ferguson are demanding his immediate release from prison. Andres Gutierrez is live in Columbia, where we're expecting a news conference to begin shortly. Andres? Good evening, Mark. The family is expected to speak any moment now. Shortly after 8 this morning, an appeals court ended up overthrowing that conviction after they found that prosecutors withheld key evidence that kept Ferguson from key, uh, having a fair trial. Let's go ahead and walk you through the timeline of events that led up to this. It starts on Halloween night back in 2001 when Kent Heathhold, the sports editor of a Columbia newspaper, was found beaten and strangled in the parking lot of his office. That night, Ryan Ferguson and his childhood friend Chuck Erickson had been at a bar nearby. Two years later, Erickson confessed to police that he and Ferguson committed the murder. During Ferguson's trial, his friend said that he had dreamlike memories of the two of them committing the murder, although there was no physical evidence linking them to the crime. Then was the janitor who said that one of the men that he saw that night in the parking lot was Ferguson. However, since then, both men have recanted their stories. An appeals court found prosecutors withheld evidence that would have raised questions about the janitor's testimony years ago and decided to throw out that conviction. Prosecutors now have 15 days to retry this case. Attorneys with the uh, Ferguson's uh, have said that they are trying to get this to go on bond and that there, if there's no retrial, that Ryan would be a free man. Reporting live in Columbia, Missouri, Andres Gutierrez, 41 Action News.